Hello there and welcome back to another episode in our IND Thought Difficulty playthrough. And uh, in this episode our goal is actually going to be uh, to build up Beaver Venice. So thank you Krieg very much for this awesome idea. Before we get into that actually, I've had to do a few upgrades in our colony. Some of you probably, well I think probably all of you, have noticed that massive warehouse complex right behind this beautiful pagoda that we built in our in the previous episode. So I knew that we are gonna need a lot of planks and maybe even some more gears as well. So I built a very similar design to what we did in Folktail, just a slightly bit higher. And um, all those hamster wheels are now gone, so uh, let me just actually hide the UI. And uh, we also have a statue for the boar, uh, boar beaver that um, didn't uh, didn't make it. We had a bit of a work accident in one of the previous episodes, so at least now we do have a statue for for him. But the warehouse in general, the idea and the design is yeah pretty much the same. We've got some uh, rooftop terraces here as well just some extra relaxation areas for our beavers it is not 100 percent complete as you can see on this side i still have to put in uh, some roads and uh, shuffle uh, some of those uh, crisp mills around just a little bit but uh, overall it's it's mostly complete and i've also set the stock to what i want to store in e each of those and the ones that are well i think maybe half of them are spare right now so they're not accepting anything right um, yeah, Beaver Venice. Now, before we get into that, a uh, couple of things that I did off camera. We have mined everything, all that metal from here. Population has started to decline as well, so I've opened up a few more beaver pots. And then uh, let's just have a quick look. What else did I do? Um, yeah, oh yeah, the, the bridge uh, section over here. So, first, I repaired the old bridge, which was missing only one link, but then I realized, well, there is no longer a straight road um, through here. So yeah, I put in another one. Um, I don't know which one I'm going to keep, but here it is. It kind of felt like, well, we've got this um, section over here. So it's going to go straight through and uh, well, yeah, we'll, we'll see. Other than that, uh, in this section here as well, I did put some more platforms and, and roofs above them as well. And um, just to avoid any future work or any sort of accidents, the workers union has decided that um, all these reservoirs that have a pretty big uh, and long drop we are starting to fence off these areas as well just to make this uh, place a little bit safer for all of our beavers but all right that should be most of the updates or at least the main ones well i actually have scheduled in uh, or or planned in uh, engines a couple of them are here as well but i'm not sure if we are gonna want them or not and a few temporary hauling posts over here i'm still not decided what i want to build here but um yeah i know all of you quite a lot of you like time lapses so the rest of the episode is actually going to be just uh, one big time lapse and to make this easier for me because I don't want to be editing uh, this for the next few hours, uh, some of it will be with the UI on where I'll be planning uh, different things in here and uh, if I have spare time um, then, <laughs> then I'll try and do some with without the UI as well. Uh, oh yes, in case you're wondering, um, I'll just quickly show you. I'm going to vault this off, temporary thing. I just want to get rid of those ruins over here and I did try and put down some flags but it just wasn't gonna gonna work uh, for some reason so yeah I'm sure there's ways or other ways around it but I'm just gonna go with something that works build a wall around it drain the water put some flags down get rid of the metal and then get rid of everything else here as well okay enough talking and we'll get uh, get right into the uh, time lapse now <laughs> 